Yo, 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 what up? It's Kizzle from Kizzle's Picks, bringing you KBO run through, KBO picks and predictions, all that KBO ness. Sorry, guys, I'm at home. I'm uh, dropping some wings into the fryer for me and the boys tonight to eat. Why not? But we got a nice full slate of KBO for you here. Couple good picks, couple good previews, and some parlays to catch. So, hit me up in the comments, hit that like button if you're new, subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell so you get notified when the videos drop. And with all that shit said, let's start the fucking video. Alright guys, so, our first game of the night here tonight is Kia versus Lotte. Definitely not going to be a 15 to 15 game today. I would uh, bet on that. Wait, I am betting on that. So both teams have been scoring mad runs lately. Well, especially Lotte, man. They're uh, averaging uh, close to 11 hits per game, just like Kia. And yeah, they've been uh, scoring a lot of runs. Oh, sorry guys. My bad. I was, uh, you know, you know what I'm doing. But uh, anyways, we got Aldred Cam going for Kia, going up against Kim jin Yuk. Aldred Cam's been really good after that first game. He was just getting used to the KBO, it looks like. Uh, he pitched against KT. Wait, Doosan gave up six. KT and LG, zero earned. And by the way, guys, you see how that fade in Casey Kelly worked yesterday? Fucking complete game, one hitter. What the fuck? I couldn't believe that shit when I saw that. Of course, he was due, though. Probably going to be the highest game score of the year, you know? That was ridiculous. But anyways, yeah, back to this. So, yeah, Aldrich Cam's looking good. Um, I know both teams are really hot at hitting, but Kim Jim Yuk also has been pitching pretty good, except this last outing where he gave up five. But that was to KT, who's been pretty hot lately. Otherwise, 0, 2, 1, and 3, where he saw Kia once in 5 and 3rd and gave up 2. So we're going to be looking at Kia first half here, maybe a first half under and a full game under. I don't know. I'm just a little uh, scared to take, uh, I think it was 12, an under 12 when uh, both teams the night before scored over that, you know. So I'm probably going to have to take Kia money line, I'm guessing. But uh, yeah, this guy's a nice lefty too, a young lefty. I think he can pitch pretty good, so maybe I will end up rolling with the unders, but we'll see. Next game. We got KT and SSG. Yuk Chung Myung against Song Young Jin. Yuk Chung Myung had a relief outing last time against LG. One scoreless inning there, not too bad. Otherwise, uh, he uh, kind of gets, uh, he's not, he's all over the map, like states pretty much. You know, I can't even really get an opinion on him here. Did he face, he faced SSG beginning of the year and he started against him over here and gave up four. So, I mean, I think this game should have some runs in it. Song Young Jin. Let's see his stats here. Yeah, he's got a few losses over here, but he's given up two, six, three, five, damn. I don't know, but both of these teams, uh, SSG has not been hitting the ball well. I think you, Young Mi Chung or Mi Young, whatever his name is, Mi Young for KT, might pitch pretty well against SSG today. And it looks like uh, Song Ying Jin, they're both so young men that they might uh, throw pretty good. I think the over-under was uh, seven maybe, and I kind of like the under for the first half there. Seven's a lot of runs, man. You never see a seven. That's crazy. But uh, yeah, we'll probably whack that, and then we're probably going to take KT to win. Uh, they're four and one in their last five. SSG's like one and four and hasn't been scoring much, so I'd be crazy to back SSG, I think, but 
I've done crazy, all right? No, but that's it. Next game. Come on. Where are we at? We got NC and Kai Woon. This is a good pitching matchup here. We got Daniel Castellano versus Ariel Jurata. Uh, this game screaming under his man. It scares me though because sometimes these pitchers can get beat up. But, uh, you know, Castellano, six innings, two earned, seven, two, six, two. Which is really good, man. Uh, Kai Woom did he face first game of the year, gave up one run to them. Uh, otherwise, I mean, he has been getting a little hit here and there. He doesn't really have uh, any shutouts like Mr. Jurata does here. Uh, Jurata's got some good games that he's pitched. I might have to go with Kai Woom to win here, man. He's gotten a lot of wins his last few starts here. He hasn't faced NC this year. But, uh, yeah, he usually pitches good. He's coming off of seven shutout innings. So, I mean, I like him, I think, against NC better than I like, uh, what's it called, Cassiano against Kai Wum. So, we'll probably go unders, man. I don't think there's going to be too many runs in this one. What did they score yesterday? Oh, Kai Wum won yesterday, too, huh? Yeah, we'll probably end up taking Kai Wum to win it. NC has been really struggling, yo. They're five and five. What is Kai Wum over here? Four and six, but they've been playing decent lately. Ah, oh, shit, I burnt my wings, man. Hold on, guys. All right, next game, we got Doosan and Hanwha. We got Royal Contra versus Moondog. Do. Moondog, Moondog, Moondog. What happened to Mr. Moondog? Look at his ERA versus them. 0-2 with a 20.25 ERA. Alcantara is 1-0 with a 7.20 against him. Rala Contra. When did he pitch last anyway? Okay. Uh, seven shot innings against NC. See what I'm saying about NC? When he pitched against Hanwa that time, I think he gave up four. Yeah, five innings, four runs. I mean, Alcantara is pretty good here. But I think with Moondog, I think we got uh, Deuce on run line in this game, guys. All right, so here's Moondog. Last time, four earned, or three earned, eight earned, four, seven, eight, shout out Samsung, five, eight, shout out LG, Deuce on nine runs and three and a third innings. Deuce on three and a third innings, six runs. So who's going to say that he can make it past the three and a third innings, ten outs tonight? Over or under 10 outs. I'm taking the fucking under. <laughs> Actually, it would be 11 outs and 10 and a half, I mean. Sorry, I'm taking the under on that. I think Doosan, they're fucking been struggling lately. They need somebody like this to get them uh, back going the way they're supposed to be going. So, yeah. Hopefully, this works out. We're going to ride Doosan the whole way. First half over. For sure. And we're going to do the whole way. Watch him come out and shut him out, right? I've seen crazier things happen. Or watch him pitch like fucking Casey Kelly yesterday now, right? I would be super mad. All right, next game. We got... Come on, man. Where the fuck you at? Cal. Yo. What the fuck? You want to fucking freeze? Hold on, guys. This is fucking stupid. Sorry, guys. Sometimes that shit happens. But next game, we got Samsung and LG. Connor Siebold, man. Not sure if this recording the video kind of stopped. So next game, we got Samsung and LG. Don't know where I stopped on it, but it was going. We got Connor Siebold. First, Dietrich ends over here, who's 8-2 and two on the year. Um, I was looking at the unders in this game in LG, but I'm not sure now. Uh, we got over here, I mean, he's pitched good the last two times he had W's. Give it up four runs, zero runs. Give up eight over here to cop. Boom. He hasn't faced LG. Has he faced Kia? He hasn't faced Kia either. Huh. 
So I'm not really sure. I mean, he's got some decent outings here. And then you go to Dietrich N, who's 8 and 2, which is surprising to me after you look at his stats. He's just on a better team. Well, he won his last, wow. 3, 2, 1, yeah, he's pitching good there. Give a 4 to Kia. Kia. I don't know, man. Kind of like them to both the pitch good, man. I'm thinking like four or five runs first half. Maybe there. Hopefully, I forgot what it is. And then, uh, I don't know. Full game under, but I don't know if the stupid bullpens are going to be able to, uh, Keep him under. We might have to look at this again. I think if it's a, a 9, like NC's game was a 9, I'm taking the over with LG and stuff. I could see that going there. Alright, well anyways guys, that's that. And hang tight for the parlay. Hold up. Alright guys, so for the first half over here. We got, we got a few here. We're going to go under 5 LG and Samsung. Hopefully, this ends correct there. Um, I was looking at, oh, shit, there. What was the other thing I was looking at there? Yeah, so then uh, next game, we're going to go Kia minus half a run. No problem. Then we got the Doosan game there. We have to... I would probably play them both, it looks like, to me. Uh, yeah, why not, right? Sorry, guys. I'm just getting something out of my car. Hold on. Uh, yeah, I roll with both of them there. And then uh, the next game, we got KT SSG. We'll go under seven. And then we're going to take Kai Woon plus half a run. With Ariel Girada. I wish it was a little bit higher than four and a half. That's just too low for these teams. So it doesn't look like it's gonna be that great with a payout, guys. Hold on. Let me just punch it in on the other phone here. Give me a second. Um, ba ba ba. So we're going under five. I think LG will win the first half, too, but we'll just take. With the under for now. Alright, under five there. Minus half a run for Kia. Minus half for Doosan. Or over five and a half for Doosan. Under seven. KT SSG. And then this Kai Wong plus half a run. So with that deuce on minus half, we're looking at 204 for ten dollars. And then with the over five and a half, one ninety-three. So it's up to you how you guys play it. I'm gonna play in both, but you're entitled to do what you want. So hold up for the full game. Hey guys, for the full game over here, we got a little bit of doctoring up to do here. Uh, this isn't right, man. Hold on, guys. Alright, here we go. So, we're going LG on the run line. I think uh, they should be able to hold Samsung down. I think Samsung's going to be struggling a little bit. We got two decent pitchers going, though. 
Uh, I just don't like the under really. It's just a uh, tough one. I just think LG is going to get enough runs to win. It's about time they uh, take over Samsung, I think. Next up, best play here has got to be Kia Moneyline only. Um, I was going to take the over, but then I was going to take the under. And it's, it's just tough, man. They got two decent pitchers going, so it's a little difficult. I'd rather just take Kia to win. Uh, then next up, Doosan and Hanwa. I think Doosan is going to beat up on Moondog pretty good here. Uh, so we got him on the run line or the money line, whichever one you want to play. Go ahead. And uh, KT, money line. And then we got to go here. Kai Woom and NC. I like both of these, really. I don't know how I'm going <laughs> to work this out here, but I like them both, man. Maybe we'll do, uh, we'll do this and that, right? We'll do those, alright, so LG run line, Kia, oh, let me punch it in, LG run line, Kia, money line, and Doosan run line, AKT money line, and under nine for NC and cat boom. Ten catches you two forty three there. Not too bad. Then if we go Kai Woom money line with what do we say? Do sun money line. And we're looking at two twenty three for that one. I guess we'll play those that way, guys. Might as well. We'll middle the money there a little bit. What the fuck, man? Alright, guys. Well, have a great night. Good luck to everybody. And let's win that fucking money. Good luck. Guys.